What's up guys, quick video today. Just wanna to talk about a question that keeps coming up in the comments, and that is about sharpening the tip of the blade. Seems like this is a trouble area for a lot of people and for good reason. So just to point this out, this is the bevel right here. The distance between here and here. This area in here is the bevel. This is the bevel width. The distance between here and here is the bevel width. Now you'll notice how much wider the bevel gets towards the tip of the blade here than at the back of the blade. Now this isn't because our bevel angle is wrong or inconsistent. As you saw in the beginning, we sharpened this on the Lansky controlled angle system, meaning that our angles are consistent and correct. Now the reason that our bevel width changes is because as we sharpen towards the tip of the knife, our blade width gets wider as we approach the spine, meaning that it's not as wide here towards the belly of the blade than it is here at the tip of the knife. This means we need to remove more metal as our bevel grows wider in order to fully apex the tip of the knife. Now this isn't the case with all knives. Some knives like the Spyderco Centifante have very thin spines at the tip, meaning that the bevel can remain a more consistent width along the entire length of the blade. In other words, just because you maintain a consistent bevel angle on the stone doesn't mean you will produce a consistent bevel width on the knife. A consistent bevel width will change as the blade width changes towards the tip, unless you change your sharpening angle to follow the width of the blade. I know this sounds confusing and it kind of is if you're not read up on your geometry and I definitely am not, so I'm kind of confused myself. My advice if you're having trouble in this area is to pay attention to the angle you put on the rest of the blade. Then try to lock in the angle by locking your wrist and apply that angle to the tip of the blade. You may notice that you're removing a lot more metal at the tip of the knife than you did on the rest of the blade. And that's okay. I would focus on maintaining a perfect angle first and foremost. Then later on down the road, if you want an even bevel along the length of the blade, you can work on changing the angle towards the tip of the knife. Remember, fully apexing is the most important thing and you will not achieve a sharp blade if it is not fully apexed. If the tip is still dull, go back and sharpen the tip. So I hope this video helps explain why the tip of the knife can be so difficult to sharpen. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video. Please subscribe if you're not already and I will see you next time.